welcome to my channel. This is my first playing vlog, so I'm super excited. Today, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be playing a three-hole match uh, with my sister. And so I'm super excited to kind of show you more of like the mindset of like each shot and like what you're supposed to think. This helps me as well too, because the more you say it, then the more you kind of commit to each shot and like visualization and everything. So let's do an intro. So this is Caitlin. Hi. I'm currently a senior at St. John's University and I've been playing for about 11 years. And Caitlin, what do you like to do for fun? Shop and eat. Shop and eat, hmm. <laughs> Me too, maybe this is why we're sisters. What's your handicap? Round of two. Round of two, Ugh. okay, it's gonna be a good match. Caitlin, how far do you hit the driver? About 265 to 270. Okay, all right, let's get going. Okay, so this is gonna be an interesting match. So she's a two handicap. I'm like a five or a six, and she drives it about 15 yards farther than me. So I hit it about 255, and she hits it like 270 on average. I think this is the game plan. I'm just gonna play my own game. I'm not gonna swing out of my shoes. I'm gonna play every shot as I normally would and stick to my routine. So here are three stretches that you can do uh, right before your round. So the first one is for your hamstring. So you're gonna come down and basically stretch out your hamstring. Okay. That's the other one. Okay. Next one uh, is really good for your shoulder. So you'll turn, take a triangle. Okay. And the last one is for your back. So. All right, you're ready to go. Okay, so she is um, 371 yards out. So she's gonna take a drive. That pretty well. She shaded it a bit into the right, into the rough. So what I'm gonna do, I'm going to tee the ball on the left side because there is a trap on the left. And usually you want to always tee up the ball on the side of like a hazard or you know something you don't necessarily want to go into. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna visualize the shot. So it's a dog leg left and there's a trap on the left. I'm going to visualize a probably like a five yard draw starting just over that trap edge and it's going to fall nice and soft just left maybe 20 yards past the trap. I'm going to take a practice swing right here. Okay, that feels good. And this is my normal routine so I'm going to take three steps keep looking at the hole step my feet my feet look pretty good and I'm still looking at that right edge that I'm going to go right over and I have a waggle and my last thought is it <laughs> So it wasn't exactly the shot that I wanted. It had a baby fade, but it started right over the edge. But I think we're in good shape. We're in the fairway, so let's go. So basically my common rule when playing golf is to always stay present. So when you're actually walking to the ball or you're riding the cart and you're not actually hitting the shot, you're actually enjoying everything that's around you how pretty all the nature is like if you really are present you see like every like crevice and actually like the beauty of these plain leaves that we actually normally would just pass by so 
it is a hundred and forty. I'm gonna play it 150. There is a trap right in front of the green, so I am going to miss a uh, long left, if if anything. I'm going to visualize a five yard baby cut. It's gonna start on that kind of like that tree that's sticking out. It's just gonna fall lightly to the right and it's gonna bounce maybe once and land right next to the flat. Let me take my practice swing. Aim right to that tree sticking out. but it faded just like I want. So it's either in that trap or it's on the green. So let's get to the next shot. This is Caitlin's shot. Not the best lie. Kind of uphill. Okay, so you hit a Pretty good shot, I guess, Caitlin. She is about 15 yards away. I'm sorry, 15 feet away for birdie. And let's go see where I'm at. Dun, dun, dun. Oh man, that is almost completely buried. All right, so I guess when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. So I'm gonna take everything I got to get this ball just basically onto the dance floor. I think I just kind of have to swing at the ball. Ooh, ooh, it's pretty good. Hey, okay. and I did just that. Okay, so Caitlin is putting for birdie. Short. This ball is going to bring a cup left. So, and I'm going to probably try to die it in. So, really, you want to do probably just go right over this line, and that's all I'm looking at. Not looking at the hole. I'm kind of just going to let gravity take its place. So, Focus, I'm just gonna start it online with the correct speed. So I got a bogey, Caitlin got a par. It's not over, we still got two more holes. Alright, since she got a par, she has the tea box. Whew. So Caitlin hit this bomb to drive down the middle, but I'm just going to play my own game. I am going to hit a baby draw, I'm going to start that really tall tree, and just fall off. Alright, I'm going to take my normal routine. One, two, three, set up, look at my spot, and f*** it. Okay, hit that really good. Execution 100. I'll take it. Excited for some in and out. Your butt. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right, so I have 170 yards. I am going to take a, probably like a pretty solid five iron and just give it all I got. Realize a baby draw. Come on the dance 
44. I think that'll be fine. 143. What are you using? Strong okay. slightly to the left. Oh, right next to me. Yes. Mine is in front, so I get a read. Team is. It's 2019, so leave the pin in. Oh, that did not break. So I saw that Caitlin's didn't break nearly as much as I thought. So I'm just gonna do a cup outside left. This is uphill, so I'm gonna give it 110%. All I want is to start it on mine and give it 110%. One more hole to end the match to see who buys in and out. Shot. Kind of running short on time, but this isn't gonna stop my routine. I'm gonna play my normal game. Right, and split the fairway. All right, let's go. All right, I'm using my driving iron because it's about 190 and headwind. It's not my most confident club, but I am going to commit and stick to it. Take one look. So that's it for the three hole match. Sorry it got so dark. That was not our intention. But if you enjoyed the video, you kind of like the more course management and uh, mental side of things, go ahead and subscribe. Give it a uh, thumbs up. Give it, give it a thumbs up. We'll have both our Instagrams linked down below. And yeah, see you next time. Bye. Bye.